You know, putting politics aside, because I know there are some people that absolutely love Donald J. Trump and other people that can't stand him. But do you really think of this New York civil trial, like honestly, just putting this, putting aside your p- political views for a second, do you really think that the district attorney proved her case? I'm just trying to get your opinion on it because she claimed that Donald Trump and the Trump organization and even his children were involved in this el- elaborate scheme and fraud to defund, you know, whatever they want to do to, to scam banks And to trick them, you know, with their inflated assets to giving them loans that they didn't deserve. And I'm just trying to see how how they proved this case. How did they prove it? I don't see it. Do you see it? Did the banks lose any money dealing with Donald J. Trump? No. They got paid back in full. Made a a fortune. Made tons of money. And on top of it, the, the banks, from what I've read... After um, reviewing, you know, the Trump organization's assets and, you know, actually correcting it from what I heard, lowering, you know, his uh, his net worth, you know, what I mean, they actually and and, and his uh, assessed real estate values of the properties that were mentioned, you know, uh, Mar-a-Lago, Trump Tower, from what I was reading, certain banks actually lowered the value of these properties and still decided to give. Donald J. Trump and the Trump Organization alone of hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars. Go figure, right? And like I said, this was after the Trump Organization even put together a disclaimer saying they're not professionals, they're not professional accountants, and this is just subject to their opinion. Don't listen to them. Go do your own due diligence. Go do your your own uh, homework. And yet... This, they, they, they claim there's fraud. Where's the fraud if you have a disclaimer? Where's the fraud if the bank is correcting, you know, according to their own opinions, they're correcting what you provided to them. They're correcting, you know, the real estate, whatever value that you claim, that you feel that Mar-a-Lago is worth, or you feel Trump Tower is worth, or worth, whatever the case may be. The bank is correcting it, okay? And then also gives hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars of loans Based on their opinion, because they corrected the financial statements. I just don't see where, where's the fraud? Where is it? The banks were paid back in full. The banks corrected the financial statements. The banks of their own free will, after doing their homework, after they're doing their due diligence, decided to give Donald J. Trump and the Trump organization hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars in loans and were paid back in full. I don't know. I don't see a victim. I don't see fraud, but again, I'm not a judge. So everything I'm saying is obviously for entertainment purposes only, but what do you think?